You're so fine, I wanna like you forever And hope you like what you sing as well Me and you could look real good together Can't you see we're both 10 out of 10? This part is cut with our new 2D bevel command have a look. All right, let's talk some 2D bevels. Um, you know, over the past, I don't know how many years we've done the bevels, but a lot of years, we've been developing the 2D bevel inside the 2D uh, environment, and then also we we exported it into the 3D environment. And that's because you have a, um, like, it's it's pretty quick in the 2D environment, uh, but more powerful in the 3D environment. So, we were thinking about how to improve the efficiency uh, overall, especially on multiple parts, because as it was before, you had to make, uh, you had to define the bevels first and then on each part you had to go in and pick each um, contour and uh, if you had many bevels yeah it was a pain in the ass to be honest um, but we've fixed that uh, we have done some really really cool things um, with automatic tool pathing let me show you okay so Inside our CAD CAM, we uh, just gonna make a parametric shape. Let's make the one I just cut here, uh, single, like that. And we head over to CAM, and we have to create a part from this. Let's just do it from our CNC. Let's do the 10 millimeters that we used, and create the part. The quality looks fine. Okay, and now just for for funsies, let's add this thing as well. Single, I could have done the part at the same time, but let's not. Okay, 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 so we have two parts here. Now you will see on the cam tab, you will see a bevel 2D command. That's a new one. If I click that, I will get this dialog in the 2D environment. So I can say, okay, this. This one, this, this type of bevel, this single edge bevel, uh, you will see a highlight on, um, on the contour. So if I hover over this, it highlights the one I'm closest to. If I hit control, it will select the whole uh, continuous um, path. Or if I have to shift, it will select the whole part. But let's do this thing, control and it creates a bevel. You'll see these lines here. That means it's a bevel. Uh, let's do it for that one. I can also jump over to the next part, like that. Create a bevel on that one. Maybe we want to have um, this type of bevel on that side. Then it will be dotted, because it's underneath the surface. And we can do a control click on this one, like that. So now we have straight cuts, we have uh, an over bevel, let's call it an over bevel, and then we have an under bevel on these ones. Okay, close. This is pretty straightforward, this is what uh, all, all of all our um, bevel commands have done, you have to define the bevel, but now to, to use the cutting command, or the, the tool pathing command, before you have to do the bevel cut, uh, and then you would have jumped in into the 3D and you had to pick all the, the um, uh, edges and the tool paths that you wanted. But now, um, it's only on single edged bevels right now. That means it's only on, I don't know if you can see this, but uh, this is a single edged bevel. If it would have been like this and this, it's a two edged bevel. Or if it's like this, this, and this, it's a three-edged bevel, right? But in our contour command, we have 
right here we have bevels and loops. So we can include bevel contour. So this is a bevel contour, right? And we can also apply loops on, on 2D cuts and tilted piercing. If I hit multi now and select these parts, that will create beveling with our contour command. So you can have 100 parts, define them and then just It's pretty good. Okay, so let's see a process right there. Just make a 3D simulation. Like that. Uh, let's see if we can change the speed. So you see, we're creating these great bevels with minimum effort. And the beautiful thing is that you can set all all of your leads that you're using in uh, in the contour command works on these bevels. So it's yeah, it's really 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 nice. I'm just gonna include. Um, let's include some of the previous versions in this video on how you did this. So you see like the power of um, the new feature, especially for multiple parts. Okay, let's do that now. You're so fun, I wanna like you forever and Hope you like what you sing as well Me and you could look real good together Can't you see we're both ten out of ten? Yeah. I will make you feel like you're a treasure There we go. Catch you in the next one.